Welcome to Ben's Experience. In this video, I will show you how to add a search bar in Google Sites. First, visit sites.google.com, then enter the website you want to add a search bar on. Let's try to add my search bar here. First, I will insert a text element and I will write search this website. Let's make it a little bit bigger, centered. I think this is good. Let's make it just a little bit bigger, just like that. Let's delete these two elements. Now go to this official website from Google called programmable search engine.google.com click on get started now as you can see i have no search engine yet click on create your first search engine now give your search engine a name for example i will call it or i will i will name it after my website name Bain's testing hosting search engine. Now you can what to search. You can search specific sites or pages. You can add any of the following. For example, you can only search individual pages. You can search the entire site, parts of the site, or the entire domain. For, for this video, I will go with the entire site. So I, you need to follow this structure. I will zoom on it. You should fill in three W's, your website name, slash this star. So in my case, my website is www.benstestinghosting.com. So I will add this part at the end just like that i will zoom out now click on add as you can see it is added here for the search settings you can allow uh, searching images on your website you can also uh, choose or enable the safe search now check that you're not a robot and hit this create button your new search engine has been created now copy the following code and paste it into your sites body section where you want the search box and the search results to render click on this icon to copy this code and return to google sites now click on this from this insert tab click on embed make sure to select embed code and paste your code here click on next this is a preview of your code click on insert and as you can see the uh, this is the uh, our search engine let's place it just under this search this website title and save our changes click on this view to see your website live and this is the search bar let's give it a try by the way uh, since we've selected to search this website if your if your website is not indexed on google it, you should you need to give it some time to uh, google bot to start indexing your pages in order to show results in this search bar now i will search for ben because my website is called Ben's Testing. So if I hit this research, this is the search result. As you can see, the, uh, I've made the search result smaller. So let's make it bigger, just like that, in order to see the results. Let's save these changes and view the website again now if i search for ben 
as you can see this the, the search results are only about my website benstestinghosting.com this is another page on my website and this is the third page on my website or on my website let's see i uh, till now they didn't uh, indexed images from this website this is why i see no results to play with the settings of this search engine. Before I continue this tutorial, I would like to let you know that you can get access to my Google Sites online course today for free. Inside this course, you will learn many things, including how to get started with Google Sites, building content, for example, how to write articles and upload videos or photos, also enhancing your Google Sites, like how to add an image carousel, a video background, a WhatsApp link, Facebook pixel, also publishing and managing, customizing and advanced features like how to add a sitemap to Google Sites, additional features like how to rotate images on Google Sites, how to resize images, print Google Sites, also another category of monetizing your Google Sites, for example, how to promote affiliate links on Google Sites, special use cases for google sites like how to use google sites to make a portfolio a blog a gaming website how to create a login page and finally managing your google site like how to index your google site and also how to export it if you want to get access to all of this today for free and also my other free online courses inside my university just go to university.benzexperience.com link in the description without any further ado let's continue our tutorial to play with the settings of this search engine simply go back to the programmable search engine let's back to all engines and click the, on the one we've just created you can rename your search engine again you can give it a description you can get the search engine code again the search engine id public url you can play with the search settings like the image search safe search you can augment results by searching the entire web you can also select the region you want i think you want the results to be based on or something like that you can all let's give it albania for example region restricted results i i didn't understand well these settings but let's move on sites to search you can add another site that you own to be included in the search results sites you can you can also ex exclude some sites from appearing for the look and feel you can edit the language the layout but this is not all i think from here you can edit the layout of the search result let's go back to the previous page you can also add members, I think, to edit this search engine. You can play with the ads, the programmat programmatic accesses. And this is how to add a search bar in Google Sites. Don't forget to give this video a like and also subscribe. Thank you.